estamos de regreso en corte y queda. Y ahora vamos con opciones desenfadadas, no todos el Oscar. En este caso es ¿Quién diablos es papá? Antes titulada Bastardos, pero se le cambió el nombre un mes antes de su estreno en Estados Unidos. Esta comedia cuenta con la presencia de dos, dos ganadores al Oscar, J.K. Simmons y Christopher Walken, pero también hay tres nominados al Oscar como Glenn Close, John Skip y Owen Wilson. Vamos a ver qué es esto. ¿Quién diablos es papá? Peter y Kyle, dos hermanos cuya excéntrica madre Helen ha criado con la creencia de que su padre murió cuando eran jóvenes, al descubrir que esto era una mentira, los dos hermanos deciden emprender una búsqueda por su verdadero padre y al mismo tiempo conocen a su madre más de lo que ellos probablemente deseaban. Esto es algo de ¿Quién diablos es papá? Protagonizada por Ed Helms y Owen Wilson. This is the universe calling, guys. The universe told me that universe. you were being nice. Oh, uh, I've got a special funny. connection with the universe. Do you agree with that? Yeah, funny. Well, is it? It's uh, okay. Yeah. yeah. Shall we start? <laughs> yes. Great, let's go. <laughs> let's do it. In the movie, it's really important for your characters to know where where they came from. Uh, and for many people, it's also important. Why do you think it starts? Well, in in some ways, I think we're. Uh, You know, we just want to understand our legacy and understand. It helps us sort of place ourselves in the in the world and understand who we are. I also think it's a little bit of a of, a, of an illusion. I mean, it's a little bit of a false pursuit in a way because we really are who we are, regardless of of those facts. That but they comfort us. They're they're kind of good to know and. Um, And sometimes they haunt us, like the characters in this movie. I'm, I'm still don't believe the cast of the movie. It's amazing, um, it's amazing astounding. Yeah. Um, could you share us one specific moment when we, with Glenn Close? I mean, uh, there is a funny scene where you are together in a picture, and she makes their eyes like, weren't you afraid that Alex uh, from Fatal Attraction were yeah, still alive? So, yeah, we were talking <laughs> about that earlier. Is there a scene where she gets mad? She gets mad at, during the photos and the wedding because because I keep harping on oh, who, yeah. who's our dad. But uh, yeah, I mean, once once I got to know her in person, she is just such an incredibly effervescent and warm, funny person that uh, no, there was no fear of. Of fatal attraction coming out. La seis veces nominada al premio de la Academia, Glenn Close también se mostró encantada de colaborar con este par. Well, I wanted to play the role because I wanted to do a movie like this, for, and I loved everyone who was involved, and I'm kind of in awe of the improvisational talent of somebody like Owen and Ed. And it's not something I've really been exposed to that much. So I'm learning a lot and, and having a great time. And I, I like the story. I mean, it's kind of, it's kind of uh, lovely to have people say such lovely things about my character all through the movie. <laughs> Talk about a blast from the past. She had the tightest ass you've ever seen. A mouth. And that tongue. And a set of knockers. <laughs> Damn near cost us the Super Bowl. She's our mom. Finalmente. You just... When you get involved in one comedy, what it's uh, your main goal? Uh, well, obviously it's to entertain people, but do you have any other specific goal when you are, in, when you are getting involved in a comedy? Well, I think if, if we can get people turned on, that's a good thing. T turned on, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Revved up. Yeah, sure. I mean, or, or do you mean like, oh, like I mean Randy. Oh, excited. Like, sort of, <laughs> you get them. Uh, yeah, that, that would be I, nice. I, I know, I, I think it, it but making people laugh is obviously really the, the best part, but I, oh, but I think yeah. sometimes the right The right movie can also just make people they, they look at themselves and their situations and or their families in this case, and maybe uh, just have a kind of warmer disposition towards their their own families or towards themselves. And that's certainly what I take away from this movie. Oh. Not the soul dragon. Desde Los Angeles para Imagen, Adrián Ruiz. Does the name Helen Baxter ring a bell? It does more than ring a bell. She was like a dick whisperer. She's our mom. 
All we did was cut. Pues es una película más del montón, la verdad es que no saben qué es lo que quiere contar, el director es aquel que fuera el cinefotógrafo de qué pasó ayer, de toda esta franquicia, entonces como que se le van las manos, desperdicia totalmente, Christopher Walken aparece unos cuantos minutos, entonces es como insulso su personaje, eh, no sabe qué es lo que quiere contar, si una historia de mamá mía o si una historia de redención y de lazos familiares fisurados que después eh, se componen, entonces es como todo un merequetengue, hay unas situaciones mejores que otras, entonces con mesura no con locura, eh, es una comedia más del montón. Y bueno,